So a couple of years ago we heard about a old mill down south in Katanning that had been turned into a luxury boutique hotel. Ever since hearing about it we were pretty keen to go down there and check it out. Well, I was pretty keen anyway. So we took the opportunity and drove a few hours south of Perth to Katanning. So you're in the purifying. Oh my god, this is beautiful. We've got the silo rooms, we've got the packing rooms, and the purifying rooms. Welcome to room 207, purifying room. Well, it's really quite nice, isn't it? Very nicely done. Beautiful. And the first thing that hit me as soon as we walked in is it's so cool in here. <laughs> nice corner room. So we've got uh, views of the town. So, wow. awesome. welcome to Katani. Quite a cool little place. Looking forward to uh, looking at their book. They have, um, they have like a guided tour of the whole building and all the mechanisms and how everything worked. So that'll be really cool. This is the cordial bar. The cordial bar is built into the basement, which was originally the machinery room of the mill. Original little staircase to nowhere. Later on it became a cellar when Mr Pierce decided to get into uh, making wine and cordials. Hence the name, the cordial bar. There's your margarita. Woohoo! Yum! The Cordial Bar has a range of tapas dishes and every single one that we tried was absolutely delicious. Extremely well. Rather than building a space in the rooms to have as a little kitchenette. It's a little communal area. Lovely that you supply a plunger and real coffee. We're in the 
dome reception. So we're about to have some breakfast. How clean are those windows? We did not realise that that is actually glass. Katanning, home of WA's first electric streetlights. Location of the original power pole. So as the sun starts to go down, we thought about some of the other food options in town, but we ended up back at the Cordial Bar. We're back in the Cordial Bar. Back where we belong. <laughs> may or may not get to dinner tonight. This is Pharaoh. Pharaoh fell down into the walls of the building. So when they were doing the refurbishment, they came across her and being that she was so beautifully mummified, they decided to put her on show. So she used to live on the bar, then behind the bar, and then she was getting damaged, so they put her in here. <laughs> So I've got to say, coming to Katanning wasn't on my bucket list. But uh, now that we're here, the Dome Cafe downstairs, the accommodation and the cordial bar is fantastic. Look, you've got to be here, guys. Absolutely. Recommend it. So unfortunately today's checkout day comes around too soon. Even though we've spent three nights here, it's just been so fantastic. It has, it's been a great place. Um, really impressed with what they've done here. It's a, it's a beautiful hotel. Yeah, it's really, really lovely. But before we go, we'll just give you a quick room tour and let you see exactly what the rooms have. So the really thought of everything, there's just beautiful appointments all throughout the room. Things like this little Bang & Olufsen speaker. Really beautiful sounds, straight Bluetooth, straight to your phone. Even like this little box. Which they call the black box. The black box. And in here, there's all these little books. Like there's a tour of the mill. So you can go and have a look and see what uh, all the mechanisms mean and what they do. Menu for the cordial bar. There's also some guides in there about the, um, the local area and what you can go and see. Pillows out in the guest valet. You can grab as many pillows as you like. Even little things like there's a USB port in the PowerPoint. So you can just plug your USB cables in there. All electronic light controls at the bedside. It's got so much character and feel into the bathroom. Quality all through. Even your amenities. Aesop, every single one of them smells divine. And the shampoo and conditioner are actually really nice on your hair. It's not that like cheap, horrible stuff that you don't want to use. These are good. I've actually bought them for home. And then you've got the shower, which is huge so much space and everything's just really really beautifully done. Even some little historical details from when this was the power generating mill which actually brought electricity to the town and it was the first town in the whole of WA that actually had electric street lights which was all powered from this building. Cool little fridge, doesn't hold much. But works really really well. Sad face. Yes, I know. This is always the really sucky part. But 
buy a super cool thing. Well, we've just checked out. It was a great little stay. Absolutely fantastic. They've just done such an exceptional job. Can't speak highly of, uh, highly enough of it. Really, really well done. Well, until next time, flour mill. <laughs> That's us away for a couple of days. <laughs> So be sure to keep an eye out for our next video, which will be on what to do in Katanning, including the Adults Adventure Playground. See you then.